The discontented often lead miserable and wretched lives, constantly complaining and finding fault with everything around them. They fail to see the beauty in nature or appreciate the virtues of their fellow human beings. On the other hand, a contented mind finds something good in everything, seeing signs of hope even in difficult situations. The spirit of discontent is not only unfortunate but also harmful. It weakens and paralyzes us, preventing us from achieving success. To accomplish anything significant, we must focus our minds on the task at hand and avoid getting lost in complaints and envy. We often wish to be someone else or have a different life, but these wishes are futile and would likely lead to failure even if granted. It's common to see people yearning for what others have, thinking that their neighbor's life is happier than their own. We tend to believe that the grass is greener on the other side, but the truth is that contentment lies within ourselves. To find true contentment, we must rid our minds of ambitious and covetous thoughts. Contentment is not dependent on external circumstances but springs from within. True happiness can be found in simplicity and appreciating the little things. The poor, yet contented, man living in a humble cottage might enjoy more tranquility and joy than those surrounded by luxury and ambition. The key to contentment is to focus on the positive aspects of our lives, even in difficult times. Half of our discontent arises from self-centeredness. Instead of comparing ourselves to others, we should be grateful for what we have and consider those less fortunate. A life filled with simplicity and the company of loved ones can bring more happiness than external achievements and honors. Contentment doesn't mean complacency or lack of ambition. It's about finding peace in our current situation while striving for improvement. If circumstances are beyond our control, it is wise to accept them and find patience. However, if we can improve our condition, contentment doesn't discourage us from making the effort to progress. True contentment is like gold, valued and respected by wise individuals. But beware of a false sense of satisfaction that keeps you from striving for better. Embrace contentment in your heart while continuing to pursue growth and improvement in life. Let us cherish the virtue of contentment, find joy in simple pleasures, and accept our present circumstances with gratitude. And if the opportunity for improvement comes knocking, let's seize it with determination and courage. Contentment, when blended with ambition, leads to a fulfilling and meaningful life.